Let's talk about how you can use the small gear in QuickBooks to improve your efficiency and to get to information quickly. Uh, we've, you've heard me talk about the large gear which is in the top right hand corner here but on numerous screens in QuickBooks there is actually a smaller gear which is very useful. So if I go for example through my left navigator and I go to sales and under customer, if I click on my customer list in here you'll see that part way down the screen I've got a little gear with settings and if I click on that little gear it expands to offer me additional columns that I can add to my screen. So I could actually put addresses, emails, attachments to this particular screen to show me more information against a particular customer. So that's very useful to do that on the customer side. The same thing happens on the supplier side as well. If I click on my supplier screen I've got the little gear there where equally I can add columns. So it's very useful to be able to add columns to transaction to screens that show information but also transactions so if I go to my expense screen here you'll see here that I've actually added a column here which shows me attachments so I've gone to the little gear and I've if I show more you'll see that I've ticked in uh, different columns and one of the columns I've asked for is attachments here and if I add any attachments to any particular documents here it would have a number of a, a number here one two etc for the number of attachments that exist for a particular transaction. So if you're attaching uh, PDFs to your documentation in here, to your transaction, then it's very useful to be able to see what has been attached and how many documents have been attached to something. That's through the little gear. The other area where I use the little gear quite a lot is in the products and service list. So again, you go to your products and service list with all your different products in there. We again, I've got the little gear option, which gives us different columns we can have and I always switch on my income account so that I know which account this particular product and service is linked to in the chart of accounts when I'm posting. So income accounts and expense accounts can be very useful columns to add on to that product and service list. So you can see the little gear is going to save you time because it's going to give you the screens that you need to be able to manage your QuickBooks.